I have to apologize for slacking off over the last couple of days. I've been meaning to do scouting report videos, but I never really got around to doing it and other things got in the way. Ever since I moved into my new place, I've pretty much been out every single day running an errand or doing something within my life that has caused me not to focus on doing YouTube. So here we are now. I'm here doing this video and today's target is no other than Hull City's defender, Jacob Greaves. West Ham's got a pretty good reputation with Hull City. I mean, that club sold us a lot of very good players over the last couple of years. So it's no surprise that a Hull player ends up in my scouting book, is it? Hull City has, I would say, a decent partnership with West Ham, and it sold a lot of players to the Hammers over the years. More recently, Robert Snodgrass and Jared Bowen have left Yorkshire and moved down to London, and they've actually proven to be successful. Robert Snodgrass always gets an honourable mention because of how humble and dignified he was on and off the pitch. He did so much to represent West Ham in a positive light. It was almost on the same par as how Mark Noble conducted himself. Jarrod Bowen's obviously just gone into West Ham United's history books by scoring the winning goal in the Conference League final, the goal that won the trophy, and he's proven to be a very excellent player. Not a few months into him signing for West Ham, he was mentioned in my Hammers Starting Eleven video that I did with Russ Budden. That's how impactful he was. We're not here to talk about Snodgrass and Bowen, though. We're here to talk about defender Jacob Greaves. This 22-year-old Englishman is somewhat local to Hull. In fact, his father, Mark, played for Hull from 1996 to 2002. Jacob was born nearby in the year 2000 and came through Hull's academy. Greaves has won Hull's Young Player of the Year award three times in a row. That's something very rare, yet very achievable and very commendable. In the 2022-23 season, he played 44 league games and netted four times. He also spent time on loan at Cheltenham Town during the 2019-20 season. Because of the personal awards that he has won, it's gained a lot of respect of the whole fans. Not only that, but he's now starting to be linked with a move to a Premier League club. And if he continues to show this impressive stance in the Championship, as he would in the Premier League, he can easily and comfortably play in the top flight of English football. I think that now is a point where he's going to want to start pushing on in his career, and there'll be no better time to do it than now at the age of 22. The Secret Scout from Daily Mail went and reviewed him. Secret Scout does not have an identity, but he or she went to watch Jacob Greaves back in 2021 and said, and I quote, Greaves is calm in possession, but knows when to give the ball a good whack. The Scout also noted that Greaves has an ability to detect danger from the front and the back and has good awareness of analysing a game. He also said that he likes to cope with tall opponents and that he stays on his feet a lot. He doesn't rush into tackles, stays on his feet when making the slides and attempts to win the ball back through crunching without actually trying to commit the foul in the process, of course. Jacob Greaves is a homegrown player as well and this certainly adds another quality to his so far, increasingly impressive CV of footballing achievements. I think that a move to the Premier League is coming sooner rather than later for this young man. And being a young defender, it's attractive to quite a few clubs. Maybe West Ham could keep this bond with Hull City up and sign him. <laughs> 